Today is our Addie Ruth ninth birthday. We can't believe it. <laughs> She's pretty excited. She just got home from school and the first thing she wanted to do was hit the park because the thing she wanted for her birthday more than anything else was a new pair of rollerblades. Actually, her only pair of rollerblades. <laughs> so she's trying them on and we're gonna see how she does. I wanted it so, so, so badly. And when I realized I got it for my birthday, I was so excited. I don't think you've ever done rollerblades, have you? I've only done roller skates. How do you think you'll do? I don't know, maybe good, maybe bad. But I'm gonna be safe because I have a helmet, wrist guards, knee guards, and elbow guards. Jason and I knew that if we were gonna get her rollerblades for her birthday, she was getting all the protective gear because rollerblading kind of cheers me. When I was like younger at Grandma and Grandpa's house, remember um, I got like these Lightning McQueen roller skates uh-huh and i was so scared on them <laughs> like, but now i'm better at roller skates when i had roller blades i was never very good at them i think i didn't get them till i was like in fifth grade i was a lot older now you're in second grade getting roller blades what, i'm a little bit know? nervous but i'm just hoping we do not leave the park in tears or with broken bones or sprains or even little cuts and bruises I'm hoping we leave with smiles on our faces only smiles here. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Addie, are you ready? Daddy, stand next to her. I'm nervous. Well, we need a helmet. Let's oh, right where's the helmet? <laughs> Most thing. Thank goodness Daddy caught the helmet wasn't on. <laughs> if I fell on my head, that would be bad. That would be very bad. We don't want that to happen today. No. No ouchies today. Take two. Oh, Take off! Scary. Oh gosh, we're going downhill. <laughs> yeah, this is the best part. Ah! <laughs> I don't know how to stop. Oh yeah, do you know how to brake on these things even, Addy? Do you know where the brakes are on rollerblades? No. No, that's probably something we need to figure out before we start rollerblading. Like that. Kick down somewhere. Yeah. You like lean back on them? I guess you like kind of like... What was that? I guess you kind of just like put a foot. Yeah. Lean back? Wait. Either back or yeah, that's good. Or you can probably just drag it to the side if you need to. Yeah. Addie is very into skating. We just had her birthday party with friends three days ago, and it was a and it was an ice skating party. So now we're moving on from ice skating to roller skating, or I guess roller blading. Wow, Addie! Kind of like ice skating, huh? All right, we're going fast, huh? <laughs> All right, I'm taking over the Addy hand holding, and I've got the camera in the other hand, so I don't know if I'd trust me, Addy. <laughs> How do you feel? Whoa. Whoa. Okay. Okay. Whoa. I'm so used to roller skates where the brakes are in the front, like, and I'm like nothing used to roller blades, so I'm gonna have to get used to both of them. All right, break time. Yeah. You're doing really good. How do you feel? Good. How does it feel compared to roller skating and ice skating? It feels different. How so? I mean, it feels like kind of similar on the ice skating, but the brake's like at the back. Is that throwing you? The brake in the back? Mm -hmm. And um, <laughs> and it's just like, it's kind of like ice skates, but on land. <laughs> so like the wheels are just like in a line. Yep. Got it, girl. Do you want to try some without me holding on to you? Yeah. Yeah? Mm -hmm. All right, I'm gonna step aside. You got it? Okay, here she goes. Good job, girl. Look at you go. I am so proud of you. You are a quick learner. <laughs> oh, she's doing really well. Addy, you are our rock climber, our ice skater, our roller skater, and now our roller blader. Yep. I now we need to get my on her off of her training wheels. <laughs> This decoder wheel from my favorite YouTube. Another cool birthday present. What's your favorite YouTube channel to watch? Chad and B. <laughs> and it even says Chad and B on the back. 
or you can decode secret messages with it. So you guys gonna go look for secret messages around the park now? That's what we're gonna do. And that sounds like fun. I did pretty good on my first day of roller blading. You did. Now you go hunt down secret messages. All right. On the monkey bars? I don't think so. I'm just doing it for fun. <laughs> Ever since we did our toy spy series, the girls have been very into playing like spies. They're always looking for the toy master, the game master, the hacker. And now all their neighbors are doing it with them too. So I think they're going to be hunting for clues around the park to solve some unknown mystery. No false alarm. What spy gear do you have in there, Addie? Oh, I have the ring of the night vision. Three night vision goggles? Two, two night vision. Okay. And this spy gadget. Okay, so it's a telescope here, a whistle here, a magnifying glass right there, um, a watch right here, which the watch doesn't work. There's a flashlight right here, and the compass right there. So it's everything in one. Yeah, and the watch, and the hacker's favorite color is orange because it's closest to red, and red yeah. they write. So if if we mix orange and red together, that there might be a clue in there. Yeah, and, and there's an orange, orange and white bowl over there. Yeah, we know. Mom, can we go over there and look at? Sure. Warning! Ah, ah, Warning! Ah, Wait, guys, try to find a G and an H. I love that Colin has no idea what's going on, but he sure acts like he does. He follows them around and shouts out when he found something and he just gets really into it. His facial expressions are super into it and it's really cute. We're stopping by the grocery store on the way home to let Addie pick out a birthday treat for dessert tonight. We had cake made for her birthday party. We actually eat it all at the party, so we have to have something tonight, some little sweet treat. So we'll see what she picks out. I'm rooting for a Carvel ice cream cake. That's like one of my favorite desserts. You want an ice cream cake, right? The Carvel one? These ones, these are so, so good. If you've never tried one, I highly recommend it. Yum. You, what did you want? Oh, you want a Carvel cake? That makes mommy so happy. What kind? Ice cream. Oh, an ice cream cookie cake. I haven't tried that. I know, I haven't either. It says it's new. It's new? Ooh. Did you go say thank you? While Jason is working on getting the birthday dinner together and while our ice cream cake is thawing a bit, we're gonna head down to the backyard and hang up some bird feeders that we made together in a previous vlog. If you haven't seen that vlog, go back and check it out. We had a lot of fun making these cute bird feeders with cookie cutters. My best is my diamond. Your diamond, that was my a cool best jewel. Is my unicorn just the horn? But I think this is a bird, I don't know. You did lose the horn, didn't you? It looks yeah. like a horse now. Yeah. We had some of them hanging out front and I thought the birds were eating them until I looked out the window one day and what did we see? We saw squirrels eating them. So mine was on the floor that the squirrels got them. I know. And then eventually mine was on the floor and then it was like all the way like near our driveway. Yep, so. I actually looked out and saw two squirrels that climbed me up nibbling on it. So we're gonna try to put them on different trees and hope that the birds get some. Although squirrels are cute, I'm okay if squirrels get them. But we did make them for birds. We're gonna see if we can find new trees to put them on and hope the birds get them this time. And I'm thinking this one's hanging on a limb that kind of thin, so I bet it's too thin for a squirrel to get across. But hopefully the birds can get to it. I think this one was one that was broken, wasn't it, Maya? Yeah. What was this? This was, oh, this was the butterfly, but we part of it broke. Remember that? Oh, yeah. The poor butterfly. All right, I'm gonna hang it up here. Whoop, I'm losing part of it. Not in a good way to get up. I'm gonna climb it. <laughs> climb it to get up to here. I found the perfect place for my bird feature. Little stuff. Does that work, Addy? Yeah, because like every now and then we can check from the screen to porch. Yeah, that's right, and see if it's still here. 
All right, all of our bird feeders officially have homes now. Do we have to keep an eye on them and see if the birds get them or the squirrels get them? All right, birthday girl, should we head back upstairs? Yeah, yeah let's have some dinner. And what else? Cake. Cake! <laughs> I couldn't find the candles, so you can't pull anything out, but we at least have to sing happy birthday to Addie. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, to you. Happy birthday dear Addie. Happy birthday to you. You should blow out your pretend candles now. Uh, yeah. <laughs> oh, blow out your candles, Colin. Blow them out. <laughs> Maya. <laughs> <laughs> Happy birthday, girly. I can't believe you're nine years old. Can you believe it? All right, thanks for watching Addie's birthday with us. We'll see you guys next time. XOXO.